This is episode 178 of the Focused Mindset Podcast. This is Cher Kretz, and this is going to be a little bit of a different type of episode. You can see it's kind of short, and it's because I've spent a lot of my time this week preparing and putting out the word about the Solution Focused Schools Unlimited Conference that Dr. Linda Medcalf does every single year. I am so excited about it. If you're listening to this right now um, in mid-July, it's happening July 27th and 28th, so it's not too late to sign up. Now, even if you're listening to this after, check the show notes and check out the website Solution Focus Schools Unlimited because Dr. Linda Medcalf always puts out such amazing material. During the school year, she even offers different seminars on solution-focused uh, methodology and a lot of of what I know about Solution Focused, I learned directly from Dr. Linda Medcalf. So um, yeah, head over there. As far as this conference coming up, I'm able to speak at it and it's super duper exciting to me. I um, I just, when I got the word that I was gonna do it, it just made me smile and then it's just come right up on us. You know how quickly the summer rushes by. This is kind of like, the last big thing I'm going to do before the school year starts, because here where we're at the school year, I have to be back at school, actually, the first of August. And then there's a lot of preparation for that, as we all know. But um, Thursday is when I'm going to talk. So what I want to do is just tell you about what I'm going to talk about and read my little, uh, I guess, the thing in the program (laughs) where it talks about what I'm going to be doing. And, uh, and that way, you know, you're just going to be educated on what I'm doing and it will kind of be a teaser. What I'm going to talk about is infusing solution focused questions into every conversation. Shocker. I'm going to be talking about those questions and how to have those conversations that matter so much. I have to tell you that sometimes when people talk to me about using solution-focused questions, they say, I just don't think it's going to roll off my tongue. I just don't think it's going to be natural. But the truth is that you will find it super natural when you already have some of those questions that work for you memorized. You think of some solution questions like the ones I talk about on this podcast And then you practice them in your mind and you're ready and you'll be surprised because you'll be listening to somebody and you'll think, you know what, I can ask them that question. And then you'll notice as they tilt the head a little differently and they think and then they put down their phone and look right at you and they want to talk to you instead of just zone out in an automatic way that when people are rambling and when they answer that question, It's going to create such a bond because they were encouraged to actually think rather than be on automatic pilot like we are so often in our conversations. So here is what I'm going to be talking about. I'm just going to read this description to you. It says, discover the art of embedding solution focused questions into every dialogue, no matter the concern or circumstance. This session will empower you with the tools to transform each conversation into a stepping stone towards solutions, fostering an environment that nurtures positivity and progress. Whoa, that sounds amazing, right? (laughs) Uh, Now I need to deliver that. (laughs) I think I can. Uh, You guys will have to show up and support me because I need an audience out there. So check the show notes or hop over to Solution Focus Schools Unlimited and get signed up for this amazing conference. Um, Every speaker is going to be phenomenal. We have these keynote speakers that I just sit on the edge of my seat as I'm listening. Uh, People like, let's see, well, Dr. Linda Medcalf herself, Elliot Connie, and Becky Taylor, who's going to talk about play therapy. That should be super interesting. And, uh, And just so many others. I can't even believe that she offers as much as she does in such a uh, compact period of time with so many speakers. The only way she really pulls it off is because it's virtual. If we had to fly all those people in, it would never work out in the same type of way. Because this is people that uh, are from, first of all, from all over the world, like I just mentioned. And also, they're all busy. They're all focused 
on moving forward with the solution focused practice being on the forefront of their mind of how to communicate not only with kids, but with adults. So as you can tell, I'm super duper excited. I do have feel the pressure after, especially after reading that out loud, I feel the pressure to deliver for sure, but I hope you're there with me. And next week, we'll be back to regularly scheduled programs where I help you navigate your life using the solution-focused approach. So until next time, live solution-focused. Bye.